Hey guys, and welcome back to Fatal Frame. Anyway, when we last left off, we uh, did a few little busy bits, got a couple of extra hidden ghosts, that kind of thing. Um, and we got the ending as well, didn't we? For leaving early and leaving our sister behind to her cruel fate. Which, <laughs> well, I mean, that was a thing. It was kind of interesting. Um, so, let's go and finally once and for all pull our sister's ass out of the fire or something after all it'd be pretty pretty lame of us to just turn around and leave her to her fate waiting for us to return for an eternity now i believe if we actually come back here to the warehouse there is a nice little extra. So, let's have a look. Yep. We go up here. Oh, that's not creepy at all, is it? There's the trapped girl. She was trapped up here for a long ass time. So, let's go. Now, we know where our sister's actually gone back to. She's not exactly having the best time in the world. As uh, she's gone back to that big house. The big mansion. Now, interestingly enough, although this is called the final chapter, if we're actually playing this on the hardest difficulty, there's actually another chapter after this one where you can get the... I think I think that's the Xbox uh, unique ending. Obviously, it's not canon, but it is a, an ending that they added into this version of the game. Um, but you have to play it on Fatal Frame mode. Yeah, that's right, because. Ooh! Forgot about this one. Really? That's more like it. Falling, well, the jumping woman. I wrote that down in my notes as the falling woman. Close enough, I guess. So yeah, um, we get our own unique ending, but you have to play it through on um, fatal frame mode. And apparently, that is extremely difficult because most ghosts are a one hit kill. Whether you have a mirror or not. So, looks like our sister has pretty much been fully possessed at this point. Is she beyond redemption? Well, I reckon she might be. <laughs> I do like this bridge. It's very peaceful. In an eerie, very ominous way. When we were small, we once went to the river that flows out of the village. That day we made a promise we said we'd always stay together. Forever. Even if we left the village, we wouldn't part. Yay. We promised to always be together, but my body is weak and I managed to not be able to follow you. You might leave me behind. Just thinking about being alone scares me. As we grow older, we'll grow apart. We were born together as one. I want to be one with you again, Yai. Then we can be together forever. Sigh. Yeah. Alright, let's drop a save. We are quickly approaching the end game. 
So once we've completed this mode hard, we will unlock nightmare mode and then we have to complete that and then then we unlock fatal frame mode i'm not sure if it's called fatal frame mode or if it's just called fatal mode i'm not sure so any other little goodies around Doesn't look like it let's see if we can go through the main entrance we can Okay. Back here. Sacred water. Very nice. I guess we'll have it. Now. Where to go? Ooh, hello. You're the awkward one, aren't you, that kind of hobbles around? Yeah. I really don't fighting this girl. God, I hate fighting this girl. Now, I'm not sure, to be honest with you. Ah, oh, fuck's sake. If she's actually worth fighting. But we can circle around behind her. Use that old tactic. Oh, she appeared right in front of us. That's awkward. Stay there. That's it. Can we get her? You know what? Wow, even that doesn't really do an awful lot against her. Um, now where is she? There she is. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we want to start saving this film, really, because we've got a lot of things we need to fight. And we're not really doing ourselves any favours by wasting this film. Come on. Now, this is where, yeah, once you get her down to about half health, she starts charging you. As soon as she starts charging you, she gets significantly easier. Come on, love. There we go. Obviously not quite done yet. Come on. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. I hate the way it baits you like that. Keep thinking, maybe, what if? But it's never worth it. Okay. Now, well, let's keep going. I don't really want to fight too many of those if I can help it. There doesn't appear to be any goodies here either. Um, I guess for now. Is there anything back here? Um, yeah, this is where we had some cool stuff. So let's have a little look on the map. Now, the family altar room is where we want to go, but with any luck, we can actually find a few more goodies and a few little extra bits. We definitely want some goodies and some extra bits because we need to be ready for the final confrontation. I think there are a few new items that have spawned. And we still got that kind of strange symbol there. Oh, hi guys. Hello. Ooh. Ooh. Now this isn't, yeah, this is the Great Hall. All right. gonna have to switch up to something else I think let's try using the, this one oh wow yeah they are really doing some damage to us man 
Okay. I think they're in the walls as well, which isn't really doing us too many favours. But that's okay. Oh, oh, hello, hello. Hello. Wow, I didn't even see him there. Jeez. Literally didn't see that guy. Just, like, materialise in front of us. We're also really low on health, too. Which is not fantastic. But that's okay. Ooh. Ooh. Actually being attacked. Being attacked by an enemy that I can't even see. But that's okay. We've got ten sacred waters. That's pretty mad. Get off me. I'm actually trying to get past you. So, if you'd be so kind, and I guess we're going to have to use another, uh, use another herbal medicine here. We've got a lot of healing, to be honest. Oh, there's one right in front of us. Didn't even see him there. We still haven't killed any of these guys yet. At least, I don't think we have. Right, we've got a double kill there, which is nice. And that didn't count, because reasons, I guess. He's gone. One left. And the sad reality of this, I kind of want to ex explore this room a little bit, but... Ooh, hello. But my concern is we're just wasting... Tons and tons of film here. But that's okay. Um, love? Where did you go? Oh, I know your arms are screwed. I know. N and that's okay. Oh, God, it's just not worth it, is it? Wow. Didn't connect. Shit. My god. They're quick. They're really quick. Not convinced this has been worth it whatsoever. But there are secret ghosts and stuff here. Now, on the Xbox version... It's definitely worth going for all these extra points. There she is. And that is because we can actually use them. Once we've completed the game. There she is. Come on, love. Come on. That's okay. We're not really doing a huge amount of damage, but... Enough to kill her. I think. Is she not dead? So she literally has like zero health left. That's unfortunate. Come on. There we go. Right, yes. We appreciate the fact you don't have any arms. But at the same time, love, we kind of don't really care that much. If I'm being honest. Now, it's that little cupboard here. Is there anything in here? Yes. Oh, I mean, eh, I guess. I suppose it's okay to have like a little Brucey bonus like that, but no, it's not super important. What I would like is some film. I would really appreciate film. So who's that? The Repentance. Oof. Okay. So let's keep going. Where are we? The stairs. Yeah, there's stairs up and around here. Cool. Wouldn't mind a save spot either. 
a little bit concerned with how much health that we've just burnt through but uh, you know we're so close to the end of the game we've got so many um, healing waters anyway we've got like 10 of those now the actual final boss of this game is a bit of a bastard because from what I've heard I haven't actually fought him yet but from what I've heard he can kill you in one hit whether you've got the mirror or not which I kind of wish I'd known about because I probably wouldn't have spent so long trying to save this uh, mirror that we have um, because obviously I've been saving it for the final boss but hearing that the mirror doesn't protect you against the final boss kind of makes that mirror seem a little bit pointless to be honest but whatever and apparently on the hardest difficulty as well they're even more pointless literally pointless ah, so of course yeah we got the what do we have in here what what are you oh I was kind of hoping for something else if I'm being honest if I'm really being picky I was really hoping for some kind of uh, not necessarily healing item but some kind of camera would have been nice All the village. Design yourself to it. I used to be just like you. You used to be just like me, huh? Or just like her. I find that hard to believe. For instance, you're not the one that's going to be sacrificed. Like a piece of meat to save the village. So, you know, you can't really assume what these people are feeling. Just accept that you were born to be killed. Pretty sure that probably wouldn't go down that well, to be honest. Oh, I don't know where I'm just running off to. Where are we here? Yeah, this is the flickering room, which goes into the doll stand room. Mm, which is good. Because we can get another picture in here. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, no. We've got to fight the kids. I really don't want to fight the kids again. Um, yes. Yeah, especially not in this room. don't really I don't think we really have the film to deal with these guys to be honest yep uh, are we actually against all of them I don't know if all three of them are here or if it's just the one if it's just the one we potentially could take that one out. Um, potentially, I suppose. Nope, it is not just the one. They're kind of all there. Bugger. Yeah, they're going to run away when we get close to them. You know what? I don't think we need to fight those guys. We're just going to get... Actually, in here might be a better... Yeah, this might be a better room. You know what? We'll try it. We'll bite. Oh, come on. I literally pushed the button, but it just didn't register. Son of a bitch. I think these were probably the most irritating fight in the game. Um, do I think that? Yeah, I think so. 
yet. Oh, yeah, because look, he literally disappears and then reappears just before he kills us. Uh, yeah, these guys really suck. Now, the thing to remember about these guys is that actually, when you fight them originally, they're kind of optional. Yeah, see, we get close to him and he'll run away. You know what? Let's just get out of here. They shouldn't actually follow us all the way back. Yeah, that little bastard. Because, to, yeah, it's just not worth our time. They're literally going to follow us now, aren't they? I'm curious in that case. Because I didn't have to fight these guys last time. So, I'm wondering if that was a chance thing. Yeah, out of a, out of a lot of the enemies that I've ever fought um, in any game that I can even think of, those kids, those three kids, are probably one of the most irritating fights that I've ever had to deal with. Because last time, when I was playing this off camera, I just came up here and took a snap of her. I had... Um, I'm sure she was in this room anyway. I had no problems with that. Is she going to be here? Yeah, so it must be a chance thing then. Because, as we can see, don't have to fight those kids. <laughs> and there is Sai. Right, now we don't have to fight those kids, which I'm eternally happy about. We can get the fuck out of here. God, they are just... I cannot put into words how irritating they are. Oh, look. Who we fight? Oh, the kids have spawned. Shit. Well, hopefully... We can just run away from them. Because we've achieved our objective. We don't need to fight them. They are literally just a complete and utter waste of time. Uh, you don't actually have to fight them um, when you first find them either. You can just literally skip past them. Now from what I've... Well, at least what's in my notes. We don't have to fight those kids again. Uh, we don't have to find anything else. I think that's pretty much all the ghosts. All the optional ones. You can piss off, love. You can seriously piss off. I'm not buying what you're selling. And kiss my loopy, wrinkly old asshole. Wow. They're really chasing us, huh? This is a problem. <laughs> I have no idea how persistent these guys are. Hopefully, we might even be able to exit this house and come back in. There's no way they're going to follow us all the way, surely. Surely. Ooh. I don't know. Yep. Yep, they're literally coming through the walls. Which makes sense, considering in you know, ah, oh, literally. They're literally ghosts. Oh, you can't force me to fight them, game. You literally can't force me to fight them. Um, what are you doing? Wait, where's the door? Oh, right. Yeah, round here. Got ya. Nope, that is not the door. <laughs> we will find the door eventually. Oh, Jesus. Nothing like a bit of tension towards the end of the game. Really, they're still following us. Curious. Oh. That's bad. That's really bad. 
Now the thing is, I'm absolutely confident I could defeat them. That's not the problem. The problem is we're going to take... Ooh, a considerable... Very nice. Amount of damage. Uh, in the process. So, we're just going to nope the fuck out of her. Family altar room. This is where we're supposed to be going. Ooh. Let's continue following the butterflies. Kind of cool the way the priests are like bowing to us and stuff. Okay. Now remember this building. You're sorry. Sure thing, sis. Butterfly Diary 6. If I stay here, someday, ye will come back for me. Can I become a butterfly without her? If I could, I'd always be near the village, waiting. Waiting at the place we made our promise. She'll come. I know she will. Eh, uh, she never did. Right. Um, so, mm, I think what I'm going to do actually, ah oh, bollocks, I was going to say I'm probably going to go back and save the game, but uh, I guess we don't have that option, because we're about to fight a pretty challenging, well it can be a challenging fight anyway. But, okay, we'll play it your way, game. We shall play it your way. As you can see, we're kind of being funneled into the end now anyway. Just having one last check around for some items. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed there's, ooh, something here. Oh, right, yeah, that's just the door unlocking. Obviously, we can't go back through that door because, you know, there's only one of us. And we need the help of our twin. Ghostly or otherwise. Um, oh, there's another save point through here, actually. At least we didn't have to fight those kids again. That would have been extremely rough. Uh, Right. Well, let's keep moving. We're coming, sis. Or something. Possibly. Moving slowly. Ever so slowly towards oblivion. Um. Right, yeah, of course. There is actually that save room through here. Oh, we can see the crimson butterflies. Ooh. You finally come for me. Yes, kind of. I mean, we're doing our best. Sorry it's a little late, but... And we did technically try and... Uh... I kept waiting and waiting. You did. And look how your patience has been rewarded. We are back. Type 61. <laughs> yeah, we're going to need that. Anyway, guys, we are out of time. When we come back, well, it's time. Let's just say that. <sighs> bit of a gauntlet. Bit of a gauntlet of pain. But um, I'm fairly confident we'll be able to get through it okay. So, thanks for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.